It's going to be Rock Dragon's knee versus Rock Dragon Chanel. And again, just to remind everyone, Chanel has to win two sets, three out of five, to be able to be our champion here. Will he be able to do it? That's the question. He is picking Elisa going into this matchup against probably one of the hardest characters to break for anybody. Mm -hmm. But not only that, it's knee Steve. So let's see how he does here in the Hammerhead stage. Get your chocobos oh, yes. ready. It's time. Here we go. Grand Finals, game number one. Steve Fox versus Elisa. All right, starting it off here. Oh, went for the power crush, but good punish there from Nee. That's actually pretty interesting, right? That, I think that power crush is minus 14, so he can't get a launch on it. Yeah, and that's the thing is that's probably why he used it in the matchup. Mm -hmm. He's really going for that. But the thing is, Steve, the compact nature of all of his moves, he recovers so quickly. It's very rare that he's really get, able to get opened up when he's poking, when he's going for those jabs. Yeah, and that down back three is not going to be as easy to use against Steve because of that down forward two counter -it tool. Oh, yeah. And you see Nee using a lot of down forward two already. Yeah, he's, he's looking for that there opening, and he is. gets it. Third time's a charm. A simple combo, first round and knee here. Chanel definitely got to be the underdog in this match. Oh, yeah. Well, the thing is, you know, Chanel has a number of characters as well. He might he might be able to pull out some tricks of his own. We'll see how this goes. But right now, it's not looking good for Elisa, at least in the opening set. Right. I believe, though. I believe. Oh, yeah. Down three to open it up. Oh, oh there's a the follow-up, but he rolls back. Mm-hmm. Pressure, peekaboo. Yeah, instant peekaboo. Going for the. Oh my gosh. He has him already in the corner. This is where he does not want to be the rocket launcher. Oh, God. Oh, the counter hit. The follow up here. What's he going to do with it? Yeah, life bar is very close here. Chanel goes to down for two, doesn't get it. Another one? No. <laughs> He's fishing hard. Oh, yeah. He's oh, waiting for the opportunity. God, That's done. the thing, too. It's like you got to be very, very careful because you think. He's only going for back one, then out of nowhere, he goes with the low. He goes with the down four, too. Yeah, Chanel sitting on his life lead. Ten seconds to go. Running two for the pressure. Rock launcher block. No oh, throw. Oh, what? He went for it in the open. Unable oh, to get the trade. Blue stuff blocked. Blue stuff blocked. 50 50 the man. And Chanel be clutch. Oh, my gosh. Holy balls. That was close. All right, one round apiece. Here we go again. This time, chopping away the legs. And that's a smart thing to do. But sooner or later, he's going to have to be very, very careful. Again. For most of the moves, except for maybe like down back three, Knee is able uh -huh. to get a big counter hit opportunity. I mean, even then, he has the down four two to complement the back one. That's the thing, you, you can't you can't get caught swinging. Yeah, Chanel doing oh. very good right now with these blow pokes. Nice, this time just rushing up for the low. He does have the life lead here, so he has the ability to just throw things out. God, Knee just dashing in his face with the pressure here. He's creating the opportunities for himself, and that's what I like to see. He's putting himself in a situation where Elisa cannot run away. Yeah, definitely. He's also baiting him to hit a bunch so he can get counter hit. Oh, yeah. Chanel not taking the bait so far. 15 seconds to go here. And the Raid problem mode. right now is he's in red, and, you know, oh. he has one of the best rage drives in the game with the Sonic Drive. Oh, my God, gosh. They're launcher. So close again. Here's he the mix-up. Sonic Drive blocks five seconds to go. Four seconds. Chanel's got the lead. Oh, oh the my counter God. Hit. And he's out of there with time he, at the last second. He let it go too early. He got hit by the counter hit down forward one to one. And man, that, that, that time just stone, bro. I'm telling you. Fortunate. He has all the stones. Okay. Man, well, wild fours, yeah, I mean, yeah, un un unorthodox. I, I didn't think it worked like that, but I mean, it's working so far. Oh, oh God, that was such a late low parry, but it works out. See, you got and you got to think of the mentality oh. too. It's like what moves are going to work against Steve. It's going to be those you know quick annoying lows, but then knees going to start low parrying in them, and he can get you to the wall. It makes things even tougher. And right now, he's pretty much wow. using the perfect game plan against Chanel. Mm -hmm. Doing what he's got, he knows what to do. Yeah, chance those out. No damage though, down two, small poke. Yeah, and even though Chanel does have this lead, he's taking risks, just throwing anything out against uh -huh. Steve, and that's why it's scary. God, it's so close every round. And the time, why down so fast? The big back one! Good and that night. might be game one for knee. Damn. Someone's gonna good. have to do something about that fist. That fist is hurting. Yo, Steve Fox. Chanel thinking it through, man. He did really well there, I thought, overall. I thought overall he did pretty good, but the thing is, you know, he was forced to play Nii's game, and that's something, a situation you don't want to be. There's a few characters, though, that can change that. There's a few characters that can control the pace no matter what. And I wonder if he's going to... Oh, man, he went to Julia. This, this is bad, I think. You think this is bad? I think this is bad. Walk us through. Why do you think, this is, why do you think Julia Chang is a bad matchup against Nii's Steve? Because what, what happens when Nii just stands there and waits? Oh, yeah, you're going to party crash. Uh, yeah, well, you're going to party crash here? You're going to be the only guy at the party, only guy dancing at the party? Uh, I mean, he's going to be, his party might get crashed. Yeah, who knows? I mean, it's going to be tough either way. You guys can see what's on the line here. Oh, yeah. Aside from the points being mm -hmm. on the line, 
Shout out to Tate Steve. We have that wonderful belt. Yeah, points are on the line. Always. Always. Always and forever. Even you know, not, not forever, <laughs> but yeah. Until the season's done. Anyways, we're going to go here into the Devil's Pit. One of the transforming stages here. Let's see how this is going to play out. And again, I don't know. I'd love to be wrong, but I think it's going to be tough for Julia. Maybe back one goes underneath the... Maybe forward forward one goes underneath the back one. Yeah, but he has down forward two. That's the thing. Okay, while standing three. And that's a tool that we rarely see from Chanel, but I think is a key tool in this matchup here. Yeah, you mentioned he has down forward two as well, but I think part of Crasher might be fast enough. Oh, yeah, it's definitely fast enough to beat things. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, he's going to have to be very, very careful how he uses it because of yeah. the ability to sidestep. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> Hope kick to hop kick, able to land it. He should be able to get the wall hey, here. Hey. Bing, bang. Boom. And looky, looky here. Now a big oh, life lead from, get away from that wall. Get away from that wall, though. Oh, yeah, there you go. Again with the launcher, not able to land it here. But again. to close it out. There's the low. Ooh, that was scary. And he, he throws like an up the lead. peace sign. Uh -huh. That's not a ton. He wants world peace. Uh-huh. All right, Neat. Starting to change it up here. Gets him with the counter and flicker jab. Not able to get any more out of it. Oh, interesting. Oh, Chanel, he really, really wants to bait something out there. And me bringing out those down forward twos now. Guaranteed. Yes, and sir. that's all guaranteed from that crouching state of down forward one. Good tech on the mad axis. Okay, wall standing three again. That's the thing. The wall standing three, not only is it safe, it restricts the movement from from me. Oh, good block. Oh, Sonic Drive. Hey, Look man. Look at this. Maybe I was wrong Look here. Maybe it is a good choice. But Julia you never know. Jake. Nee is one of those guys that can make adjustments on the fly. He has the latest Ooh. firmware. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice down forward one. Not in the crouching state, though, but still has another opportunity. This could be big. And, you know, he was brandishing the bow and arrow there just out of range. But the thing is, Nee is always in and out. Oh, yeah. Here we go. He's Peaking floating like that butterfly. Sticking oh, like that bee. Oh, man. Okay, good punish there. But, again, nice life lead here. Chanel's going to have to put in some work. Goes for the first hit out of range. And that's a good way to test it, too. 10 count. See ya. Good night. All right. Nee answering back here. Infinite stage now, effectively. For the oh, next yeah. couple rounds. There are no walls left here. There's only places to run, and you could backdash into the lava if you want, but you're never going to reach it. Yeah, Julia's wall carry advantage taken away at this point. Oh, yeah. And the thing is, I feel like Nee is waiting for that opportunity. You know, Chanel's been going for that down forward, oh, too. Oh, God. Oh, man, that was a big trade there. And in favor of Nee right now. Yeah, into the mix-up. Albatross, peekaboo, follow-up. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Hey. He has another opportunity just like that. Ooh. And look at that, the life lead in favor of me. Me looking to tie it up on rounds. Oh, oh good no! night. Good night. That's oh, what you get God. for sleeping on the ring earlier. Here we go. Chanel needs this one. He needs this round. Party crash getting it, but me with the low parry. He's too good. It looked good early on, but look at this, man. The man has made the adjustments. Chanel's going to really have to pull things out here. He can do it. He can do it, I believe. Oh, I believe too. But, but he's he, got needs to, he needs to land that hit first. Oh. He makes oh, oh the right call. he tried. That was against a party crasher, too. Yeah, a couple times now. It's not over just yet. He's got the raid. Oh, he's not going to be able to use it. Knee goes up 2-0 to zero now in this grand finals. Are we going to have the clean sweep? Chanel's thinking it over. He's thinking it over. What's he going to do here? Chanel doesn't look like he's in the best condition right now. No. Look, at, look, at, look at that, that maybe, look on his face. Maybe Chanel should use Brian. This is tough. I, I, I think the wall that is, you know, knee Steve, it's so hard to counter. I feel like the only choices here are probably going to be characters like Akuma. Characters like Geese. Really? That's in my opinion. I mean, he's going to stage select. I think he's sticking with Julia. <laughs> no, no, he didn't. He actually went back to character select. Oh, did he? He did. What did he pick? He went Elisa Boskanovic. Oh, okay, back to the main. Okay. Putting his tournament life on the line with the man. I like that idea. And we're going, I think, to Mishima Dojo. And the thing here is, because he picked Elisa and Nii having a 2-1 to lead, he's, he's stuck with Elisa. 2-0 lead. 2-0, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. He's stuck with it. But it's his main, right? You got to go down. Yeah, but did you main. see how bad it was early on? I did. But he can do it. All right, Mark? Come on. You got to believe. Yo, do you guys believe in Chanel? What do you guys think? Can he get it done? That's what I like to hear. Let's go. Or is Nii going to snap on everybody? Yeah, no one wants to see that. <laughs> no, no, not today. All right, again, look at that. Just just with movement alone, he already has him in the corner of the stage. Pressuring. 
just the thought of landing that counter hit back one, the down forward two, everything. It opens it up for the entire arsenal. Oh, look at that sway. He's starting to use uh -huh. other instances here offensively. Yeah, I believed in the Elisa. Oh, gosh. Oh, counter big counter four. hit. Yeah, and that's going to help out in a big way. Not going to get the kill here. There we go. But a mix up could do it. Yeah, the back one. All right, let's go. Round one, Chanel. Okay. Yeah, no counter. That's perfect. That's all you want. Hey, yeah, hey. Don't, don't get caught pressing buttons. Doing a great job so far, but again, he's pressuring him to the corner. And maybe that's where Chanel wants to fight. Maybe he wants to be put in the corner. Chainsaws immediately blocked. If you can make Lisa block any attack, the Chainsaws do get put away. Oh, man. So dash from me in the back. One. I was waiting for it. I didn't want to say anything. He knew it was coming. It had to come eventually. Oh, to the wall. And he gets the Masashi. The follow-up here. Oh, yeah. my gosh. So much damage. All right, tied up on rounds here. And this is it, this is really dangerous grounds here. Oh, oh. my God. On the wild daddy four? Even the quickest of moves that you have available, nothing is safe. Oh, my goodness. Homie attack too far away that time. And knee in total control here in round three. Chanel back one, goes to the poke. Knee defense, holding up and everything else so far. Nice pickup. Oh, but the sidewall so kind of ruins that mood right there. Nice block on the rocket launcher. Chanel's got rage. Can make something happen. Rage drive is blocked. 50-50 gets the low. Yeah, he had a good opportunity. Oh, Again. He oh the... And just like that, tournament point for knee. And this is going to be tough. He has a, a, a huge hill to climb. And Nii has been landing those counter hits. He has to have a, a read on Chanel's rhythm. Man, look at him. He's feeling so confident. He's dashing in Chanel's face now. Yeah, and just really, really tough to deal with. You know, mixing up that quick poke there, the down forward one, mm -hmm. in conjunction with the two big counter hit baits. The confidence. Uh, he's chopping away at the legs, and I like seeing this, but he's going to have to be very, very wary of the low parry. That momentum shift can happen at any moment here. And Chanel, if he's going to pull something out, he's going to have to do it now. Man, they're just going back and forth. That needs to still stick right in his face. They're about even on life. 20 seconds left. Chanel trying to stay alive in the tournament. Need trying to close it out. Get this tournament victory. Back-to-back -back master event victory. 12 seconds to go. Nobody in rage yet. It's right. going down to the wire. It's going to come down to this. He, he has to lead. Time's not finished. No! Chanel staying alive. Final round, game three. Still tournament point for Nido. And he's playing it right. I mean, he's doing a great job letting Nii mm -hmm. whiff, letting Nii come to him. Woo, oh, it's it the second time. hit. See, and sometimes you have to do that. Shoe shine, let's go. Now with the life lead. Keep with the poke. Oh, man, that was beautiful, the range with it. Yeah, and he's doing a great job of not getting hit by the back one. That's he's the thing. Oh, up, no. Though. Oh, bad position. This is really bad position. Steve is really going to get back to the wall. Down back three. Oh, he's flying out of there! Get out of there. Albatross chasing him down. She's got wings. Oh, God, the rocket launcher. He wants to take oh, the tournament. Oh, no, the entire arsenal here from Steve. Rage mode for Chanel. Last chance for the tournament. Dang, oh, that it. was big. He ducks it. He's going to finish the combo. He's got to finish it. Boom! We're living. We're living out here. So, Let's go. it's going back to the drawing board. Is Nii going to stick to Steve? He probably might. But uh, an impressive showing there from Chanel. Oh, yeah. We're running it right back. He's Nii going straight rematch. to rematch. Yeah. He's like, all right, you got one. I'm taking his back, though. Not phased at all. Let's see how this one plays out, of course. Again, back to the dojo. Chanel's got oh, faced on. Yeah, counter. No. Down four two. One of the few counter down four twos he's been able to land so far. Yeah, I mean, most of the damage, at least counter hit wise, has been coming out of the back one and everything else. But that down four two is really going to be big trouble hey, for hey, the hey. other pokes. Oh, and the perfect for me. He didn't like giving up that game. He wants to close this out immediately. Fight. All right, another opportunity here. Chanel trying to find that spacing early uh -huh. on. Gets the hit, and now back to the wall. And he's going to have to deal with this. Oh, nice power crush! And that's the first time we've seen it since earlier. Shoots a rocket to the sky. Pop off, baby. And again, tightening it up. I see what he's doing here. Mm -hmm. Trying to catch him on the sidestep, but man, Steve, such a tough character to deal with up close. Like, didn't hit a button, didn't cop, countered by that down forward two, and still neat. Keeping the wall press, just dashing in the face. Rage mode now for Steve. Got to not get hit by that Rosonic drive. I'm so scared it's going to hit him. Yeah, out of nowhere, too. And the thing is, it's so fast. And it could... Oh, right. my gosh. He didn't die from it, though. Still so deadly. Oh, my God. 
Oh, good. He landed it. Rip, you jinxed it. it. And just like that, again, tournament oh. point for Knee. The Sonic Drive. Oh, oh the counter God. hit. Counter hit while standing too. And that's really been the name of the game here with Steve. Counter hit City. It's so good. All right, Chanel, half a life bar behind. Knee looking to close it out here. He's dashing in his face. Oh, it's so he scary. I mean, w. how do you deal with it? Throw something out. What do you, if you throw something, you're going to get counter hit. Oh, oh he picked threw up it out. Two. He gets to the wall. wall. Oh. What kind of mix up are we see? He has the chainsaws, puts them away. And again, just chopping away. They're about even on life. Yes, now bringing it back. Oh, God. Don't get counter hit. Very, very scary uh. situation here. Goes with the low. He's going to go again. Oh, the rocket launcher, the whiff, but not able to punish it. He wants that wall flat. They're jockeying for position. Life bar still neck to neck. Yeah, 10 seconds left. It's anybody's match, but oh, Chanel oh. fighting for his tournament life. Don't get to fight again. Oh, oh he has another that. chance. Four, There's no three, time left. Two, oh, he went for a throw. One, I can't block. believe he went for the throw. Okay, okay. We live it. We live it. We're still in there. And Chanel staying alive. The crowd rallying behind him. But Nii just proving to be too strong. Look at that defense, blocking that low, getting the punish. Oh, and the flicker too, the follow-up. He's always got the life lead. Yeah, this Chanel's is the got thing. to poke his way back without getting countered. Big lead this time for Nii. It's a race against Simon, oh, the life no! bar. One more hit can do it. Peekaboos. He's looking to close it out with the perfect. He oh, he it. gets it. CEO 2019 champion. Give it up for Nii.